as you can see the cat is following the set of instructions and performing the task on the stage these blocks i have taken from two different block palettes one is motion and the another is control a script is performed when when one or more block is joined to perform a task the script is placed on the script area so as i have mentioned this is a script which i have made move 10 steps forever turn 15 degrees so this is a script which i have made okay and the cat is following the script this is the script area where i have mentioned it now it will be script area the blank gray area on the right of the block is called script area this is the area where the blocks are dragged and placed to create a script we are talking about this area where we uh, where we drag the script from the block palettes and we connect it with one another like this and you can see the cat or the sprite is following the script which i have created in the script area by dragging the blocks working with a script creating a script there are three basic steps to create script in the scratch these are as follows click on any block menu from the blocks palette to open its block list let's say right click on looks so you can see it has opened the blocks related to looks if i click on sound it will open up the blocks related to sound i clicked on motion it opened the blocks related to motion block palette drag the required block from the block list and drop it on the script area the x and y coordinates shown in the scratch window indicates the sprite position while the direction indicates the orientation of the sprite this is the scratch window and as you can see the position that is the x and the y coordinate as well as the direction is changing right now the position of x is minus 35 and 12 x and y this these two coordinates tells the position of the sprite direction tells the position that where the sprite is looking now if as you can see it's changing the direction is being shown in 180 degrees after 180 degree it will change to negative 180 degree Edit the white edible field of the block as per the script program shown. So these, these white edible, this is the 10, 15, 15 which is mentioned. These are edible. We can edit now in place of 10, I am typing 15. So as you can see, in place of degree, 15 degree, I am making it 30. So these are the white edible field 
which we can add it as per our requirement. Now once we have changed this, let's see what changes have done. The movement of the cat has become little bit faster because we have changed the turn degree from 15 to 30 which makes the movement or rotation of the sprite more faster. To add multiple blocks in a sprite, drag new blocks on the script area and add them either above or below the existing blocks. We can add more blocks in this. Let's say I am bringing this also. So I am adding it. Again I can bring it. Again I am adding it. So this is how we can add more script, sorry, more blocks to the existing script. Rearranging a script. Once the script is created, you can move it anywhere on the script area. To move the stack of block, click on the first block and drag the script where you want to place it. To delete the entire script, right click on the topmost block and choose delete option. You can use the duplicate option to create duplicate block on the script area. You can also split the script into parts by clicking and dragging any block or set of block from it. So what they are saying? I can drag the block anywhere I want. Okay, I can move out the script. I can delete a block. As you can see, it is being deleted. If I want to create a duplicate, P, uh, duplicate, I can click on it, duplicate. Now, as you can see, two sets of block have been created. Same. Okay, so. I can select it, I can use it as I want, I can drag here and there, I can delete the block, let's, as it see, I can duplicate the block that is, I can copy it, running a script. Click on any block of the script to run it. To execute the script multiple times, you need to click on the block again and again. So let's say, here's a block, let's delete them out first. If I'm clicking on it, you will see that the time I'm clicking on it, the cat is rotating. So to execute a script, you have to click on it. So right now I have to execute this script. I'm clicking on it and the cat is moving. If I have to do it multiple time, I have to click it on multiple time. Opening a new project. To open a new project in Scratch, follow the steps. Click on the file menu. Click on the new option. The new project appears on the Scratch window. File, new. You will say replace the current project. You will say OK. And a new project is being opened in front of you.